Welcome back, folks. Green Beef here again. Uh, we took this bad boy last episode, and we are stripping it down. The Mayakuri Niasari. <laughs> I think I said that right. We'll see. Oh, well. Uh, what else are we going to do? We are starting to recharge all the shields after that battle. I'm trying to get this thing built out. We're working on this. That's right. That's right. So we're going to get this nice couch here. We're going to have this. I might give him a nice little arcade cabinet to keep him busy. Give him a little something, something to do. Uh, I need to get more power. I need to get the... Uh, I need to get the atmospherics and stuff going over here. Trying to avoid the pizza box effect. Really trying. All right, let's go to life support. Let's get a gas scrubber back here and here. Uh, I mean, not a gas scrubber, an O2 generator. That's what I'm trying to say. We'll get two gas scrubbers. Apparently, I can't do two. Ah, uh, huh, odd. Okay, we'll get two of these. And then we'll go with... Uh, I guess we'll do a door right here. Then we'll do a door right there. And maybe I'll throw a thing there? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, well, let's go back to power. Let's go to here. Really? I cannot put that there. That is very odd. Uh, what I'm going to do is this and this. And then I'll have a local power source to keep it running for a little bit. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm going to slap this here to cover this area. And I think that'll do for now. Um, if I move this out of here, I can throw lighting. Kind of like the dark lighting in here, though. I think it works pretty good. I'm going to start throwing some walls here, actually. Keep this going. Mm, yeah, here's fine, I think. For now, we'll do that, and then once these are up and running, I'll actually rebuild it. Although I'm kind of screwing myself with that, so let's cancel that one. That way they can come around here. But we'll move all this back there, and all will be well. Mainly waiting on, I think, power blocks and tech blocks to get done. All this is going to be pushed over here, and then it'll be federated out. There's a lot of work going on. Let's check our assignments. If we look at ships, I have all these guys set to live. No, you're supposed to live here. Come on. <laughs> you need to do that. Uh, and I'll have to look at what they do. I mean, I could make another tab that's just for these guys and track that info. Let's see. They're all assigned to here, but why aren't they showing up? Oh yeah, they don't show up there, do they? Yeah, I feel like there needs to be another tab just for these dudes. So if we have Michelle, what do they do? Skills, that's it. Industry, medical, and mining. So they're going to work on the drifty bits. Let me just uh, prioritize that. Your work should be here. Everybody should prioritize this. You can rest there, but your job is to prioritize this. My god, I've got a lot of... Uh, I got a lot of guest workers. <laughs> Brandon, you get over here. What are you doing? Get on that Portia ship. Um, yeah, all that's good. Let's bump that up. Let's go ahead and uh, look at the rest then. So we've got... Which one is that? We've got Michelle working there as a priority. Who else do we have? we got Daisy. What do you do? Uh, you're good at construction and mining, so you're also going to prioritize that. Or prioritize that. That's Daisy. Where's Daisy? Daisy, 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 Daisy Dukes. There we go. Nope. Crap. <laughs> I clicked the wrong thing. Okay, there we go. How about you, FSI? What do you do? Nothing well. So you can just generally work wherever you need to. You know what? I'm going to prioritize you working on derelicts. Yeah, there we go. Kezia, you're good at construction, piloting, so you're also going to do that. 
Kezia, Kezia, Kezia. There you go. Get on there. I've got any got of them. Cool. Who do we have over here? Old Kenneth. Let's go to Botany, so you're definitely going to work there. Let's see if there's anybody else. Kenneth is Botany. Um, David is Botany. Let's work with that. Kevin and David. Mm hmm. Kevin is David. You're going to prioritize working here. Where is Kevin? Oh, it's alphabetical. Why do I not see a Kevin? Uh, what? Oh, it's Kenneth. God. Too early, man. It's too early for me to be playing. <laughs> Clearly. Uh, who else do we have? We got Ryan. He's just generally good at things, so I'm going to have him prioritize working on derelicts. Boom. Who else we got? Yeah, the nice thing is I can recoup a lot of this space and I can make individual bedrooms. Oh, man. It's going to be awesome. Well, the prisoners get processed over here. Such is the idea. Um, who else we have? Drew. What you do, Drew? What you drew? Uh, you're good at construction and mining. I'll have you prioritize derelicts and working on the drift events. How about you, quest? Med mining, medical, yeah, you're gonna work there too. Whoa, whoa, what's his problem? Uh, bad environment, catching my breath. Why? Just not that much O2? Okay, well, let's fix quest. Uh, quest you do mining, okay, so... Prioritizing, working on... Do, do, do... There he is, working on the drifty bits. And derelicts. Ah, uh, what else we got? Anybody else floating around here? Brandon. Susan Brandon. Ah, uh, you're good at shielding a lot of stuff I really don't want you to be good at. Maybe I just need to recruit him. You know what, Brandon? Oh, I can't recruit him. <laughs> You had to do it, make him a prisoner. Well, sorry, I was gonna recruit you, but I guess that's not happening today. I'll have you, I guess, just generally work. Sure, <laughs> sure. Who do I not have? Kezia is doing their thing. Uh, yeah, that, I think that's everybody. Yeah, I'll let him just kind of generally do whatever he needs to. That's fine. He can do logistics and stuff. Cool. Well, that's some effective use of time, I feel. Everybody else is kind of set up. I don't want Dylan White working anywhere else. I don't really want Mark Little working anywhere else. So I'm going to turn those off. Um, prioritize work on these. And then Alberti, I'm going to do the same for you. So you're way up here, aren't you? Yeah, no rest time. You're going to work here, prioritized. I don't want you going off ship. I need the captain on the ship at all times. Oh, so we got some of that done. All right, good. Good. This will be done here shortly. Oh, yeah, these bedrooms are getting done. You guys will be able to chill out at their leisure. Yeah, the lack of toilets may be concerning. So what I may do is... Hmm. I could move this up one, maybe? What would that afford me? I wouldn't have a door here. Uh, I mean, I could move this out. That is an option. I can move this door here. I can move this here. Oh, yeah. Now we're talking. Let me do that. I'm going to delete this, delete this, delete this. We'll probably move this. Yeah, we're going to give him another toilet because I feel like there's a little bit of a bottleneck there. 
Okay, this is going to feed into this. Actually, this will be a two-way. Doesn't have to be a one-way. This will receive from this guy. And this guy will jack into that node. Yep, uh, I think that'll be just splendid. Uh, what I'm gonna do, I guess, I need to rework some of this power. It's a little, it's a little off. It's a little excessive, I think, in places. There we go, we got tons of space there. I'm gonna set them up a nice little light. Make them a little more comfy. But yeah, if I get rid of this, I'll leave that there. What I'll do is I'll move this. Nice. This is gonna have to move. Do I even need this at this point? Or do I just use a wall power node? I don't know. What work I know what I'm going to do though is this. Unhappy, because he's standing inside of a construction site. <laughs> of course. Uh let's go ahead and do wall. Right there. I'll throw a door here. Uh, how is our power overlay? That covers all of this. If I were to move that, that would not cover. Actually, that is already covered. Um, let's see, if I move this here, it almost covers everything I need. Hmm. But that is already covered there, isn't it? Not quite. Not quite. So this little tile is not covered. I'm, <laughs> God, power is always a problem. Hmm. Let me just look at my links real quick, and then we'll deal with that another time. I don't need that link. I'll do a two-way to that. That will cover everything I need there. That's getting juiced. Nice. Good deal. How are we doing on this? Are we not doing anything? Nobody's doing anything. Expedite that, please. Jeez. Strip everything down. I'm gonna put all of these guys on two shifts. One on, I guess, shift one. With no break in the middle. Because, <laughs> you know, that's... That's what they get. Uh, it's funny, you got Dylan White as the one guy on here. Well, we'll copy this. We'll paste it. Actually, I don't need to paste it. It's already there. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So, we'll have five on five. Um, we'll do one that is sleep. Get free time on both ends, and then you go and work. And I'm gonna copy that and paste it, paste it, paste it, paste it. That's five and five. I think that's gonna be good. Actually, I'll give them like one extra hour of sleep. It's fine. They can they can rest up. They probably don't need that much sleep, but whatever. This way, I don't have nearly as many shuttles coming back and forth. That's my goal. Dylan White, the sole dude on this ship. I mean, at least he's got a shoddy. I'll give him credit for that. Uh, this can move up one, I guess. Is that going to give that coverage? Actually, I can move it back one. Let's do that. And let me like that in there, and that in there, and that in there. Nice. Let's build a wall here. Cool. Now we're talking. Let's go to furniture. We'll give him a nice light right here. Cool. And a wall thermal regulator. Cool. So theoretically, I might be able to get two toilets in here if I really cram it in there. But I'm not going to. Not yet. Let's look at the comfy level. 
Dylan White's doing pretty good in there, not gonna lie. Is this thing damaged? It is. Oh, I gotta set auto repair on this ship. Let's go to settings, auto maintenance, there we go. There, there should be more than enough beds here. Ah, uh, what's up, Ikoma? Don't scan my ship, please. <laughs> I've got nothing of interest, despite actually having something of interest. Let me... Do I have enough of these? I don't really have that much, uh, Hyperium. Let's do a little trade. I'll trade you from Zapiros. Uh, what do we want? I mean, I could always take more water, of course. Yeah, I'll buy your water. Ten of those. In exchange for... What? I'll sell you some carbon. I got a bunch of that. There we go. Good trade. We'll boost some of that relation. Uh, let me bump that out. And that. What are we waiting on here? Tech blocks and soft... Or infra blocks? We should have enough. These tech blocks are killing me. What do we got over here that's taking forever? That six. Holy crap. That's a good amount. Hey, you guys better get to work, man. There's a lot to be done here. Give me this. Oh, we got a little defiance. We might have somebody break on the ship. Um, let's see. I could probably strip all this down because I don't need them on here. Yep, let's start dismantling this stuff. Let's go to permissions, we'll clear prisoner area, we'll clear the slave area, done. And I'm gonna start deleting these things, man. We're gonna make room. Hey, we got the targeting jammer. I think it's just one little thing down here. Yep, the CO2 producer. We're gonna research that and then be done with it. <laughs> cool. Getting this done, uh, I'm going to delete these. I'll leave the power in place for now and we'll figure out what we want to do with it. But... And now that these are done, I may rearrange some things. It's a start. It's a start, that's for sure. This is mainly supposed to be like a work ship, so I may double up some of the production facilities just to keep it going. Like, take a lot of the raw resources and process them, in, process them into something else, just so we have something better to sell on the back end, instead of raw resources. Let's we'll also recoup a few tech blocks for us to build some things. How you guys doing? Again, pretty good at this. Doing pretty good. But that trade's finally done. It only took forever. I'll probably get more poo processing plants here and move a lot of this stuff to the central location here. Maybe get more solar here. Expand this, move this stuff inward. Maybe put a spacesuit locker over here so in case this catches fire, it doesn't burn down the entire ship in one go. That'd be ideal. Maybe move this stuff and then get another airlock right here. Mm hmm. Quite a few options. Quite a few options indeed. How's this working out for him? Yeah, pooed his pants. It's okay that he pooed his pants though. He'll figure it out. Yeah, because we got eight beds. It's more than enough. For our ten workers. How are we doing on this? Just about to cross that threshold, so I think what I'm going to do is... Uh, put in... Another hyperdrive. Yeah, there we go. And that's more than enough. Looks like we're doing fairly good on energy rods right now. Everything else is coming together. I'll take these. 
I'll take all that food, send it. What are we doing on whole scrap, by the way? Not a lot. So that thing is probably dead as far as O2 and stuff. Yeah, they're already wearing spacesuits. So I am going to trigger the whole scrapping. You know, other people working on it, rip it apart. There goes the Akoma. It's gonna get fixed eventually. I need more crew members for his ship. So, who do I want? Necromas, why did you poop yourself? Jeez. What a guy. What a guy. Alright, let's start deleting some of this. All that will go quite nicely. Let's delete all of this. So, on the day I've recorded this, the day before, uh, they announced a lot of the features of Alpha 12. Looks like it's going to be pretty fun from a quality of life standpoint. Logistics robots are a big one. Adding windows. And some other stuff. Hey, what's up, Slavers Guild? I bet I know what you want. Let's chat, shall we? Come on, anytime now. Who's going to be the caller? Scorpius, get on the comms, please. Oh, you're running low on slave callers. I will sell it to you for a thousand bucks. You bet. Godspeed. Let's chat. Oh, that's not you. <laughs> that's you. The re-exodus. The re-exodus. I feel like it's more like reing. Well, I'll take that money you gave me. <laughs> Just put it towards stuff I'm going to buy from you. How does that work for you? Actually, I'm going to save myself some effort. I'm just going to buy a few of these. I will sell you some missiles. There we go. We'll just offset it a little bit. So really, that only cost me about a thousand. What's not on the power grid? Oh, no. Oh, no, Kool-Aid man. Let's go to power. Let's get a big old power node right here. Yeah, I think right here is good. That'll flow some good juice into things. What are your complaints? That you're working too much? This is still is not built? Man, we're just waiting on tech blocks, aren't we? It's like a big bottleneck for me. Why? What are you waiting on? Those? And this is waiting on that? And what is this waiting on? Somebody to do it? <laughs> Apparently? Okay. Fair enough. Why are you just hanging out there? Why are you backwards? Oh, that is that is the right way. <laughs> Never mind. Well, cool. Things are happening. How is this? Is this about done finally? I think it is. I think we're almost there. You know, this lovely hull scrap. There's not a lot of stuff on here that I really actually want. It's just doors and tables and crap. And I think I'm doing well enough on that. But maybe not. Maybe I need it. Maybe I need it. That's finally getting done. So is this. Can I get another gas scrubber here? Facility. Gas scrubber. No. Weird. I cannot overlap those. Odd. I would think that would not be an issue. But I can always move this over there. So what are we looking at here? How's my heat? Nice and toasty. <clears throat> We're handling this heat dispersion quite nicely. Cool. Oh, we got a civilian ship coming in. We're still not hostile with them. That blows my mind. Sirius, what are you doing, dude? What happened? Did you get stuck somewhere? Probably. How are we doing on this? Just about done moving things. Ish. Is there anything else on here that I actually want? I'm going to tell them to stop scrapping that. Stop doing soft. Because I don't really care that much. Everything else you can just focus on moving freight. Getting stuff out of here. I think this is a really cool ship though. I think this really turns out good. Uh, good day, Paradox. 
He's got a lot of shields. You're a juicy, tempting target, but not right now. I'm willing to keep you guys friendly-ish. Yeah, I'll buy all your stuff here. It's just gonna be a little bit of money, which I have quite a bit of. I'll send you some shotguns in the room to offset that cost. Seems like a fair trade to me. Oh, this is finally gonna get built. How are these doing? Oh, this needs to be jacked in. As opposed to off. Uh, <laughs> let's go here. And then we'll um, send this to that. And that way we have a two-way relationship going. I'm gonna delete this and this, and then we'll move this and probably that. Maybe get more storage in here. See how that goes. So I could get another storage thing here. All right, I think we're finally done with this ship. <laughs> Let's get ready to get out of here. Insufficient resources, my butt. What are you talking about? It's not even showing anything missing. <clears throat> Hyperium, yeah, yeah, we're, we're low on everything. I am aware. I am quite aware. And we're jumping. Jackpot. <laughs> I need to select some crew for the uh, other ship, whatever it's called. The port, yeah. All right, so yeah, we got to get this. We're going to mine all that. Ooh, it's going to take a hit on our shields. It's worrisome, to say the least. Oh, there's a derelict here. I didn't even see that. We'll drop in here. So yeah, with the uh, new patch coming out, one of the big things is they've added the 2 by 3 ship as a real thing, not just as a uh, modded item. Really cool. I don't know what I'm going to do with that, so I will have already put up a voting system, so if you guys want that, please vote on it. It's under my comments, my community posts. Who do I want to send out? Team 3, how you doing? Probably good enough for this, this venture. You have one shuttle ready, go handle it. You are spread across the fleet, so never mind, I'm not going to do that. Uh, team two, how you doing? Not great. I'm gonna take you three out. We'll get you a shuttle. In fact, it'll be that one. You're gonna dock there. Where is somebody else? Okay, you're there. We're gonna send out a two-man team involving these two crude dudes. There we go. Well, you got somebody else. Get out of here. It's not your job. You're gonna dock here. You're gonna do some recon. If you need backup, we'll send it. Maybe we'll launch some rockets at it. Alright, punch open that door, please. Let's get out of here. Let's check out this wing first. Hopefully we don't get isolated. Alright, this room is clear gonna hit through here and hopefully it's clear spicy and dicey right here still clear interesting maybe nothing on this ship as far as hostiles go anyways I think we are clear yep the Stelios <laughs> Stelios whatever you know what I mean uh, we're gonna take that that's not a bad haul not bad at all. Boom, boom, boom. We're just gonna strip it down to nothing. Great. We got a whole bunch of mining. Ten of that. Fifteen of that. That's crazy. That's a great haul for me. What else can I work on? This is almost done. Being stripped out. Let's get rid of any other existing walls that are sitting here. That is all deleted. I'm just gonna delete that for now. I'll probably do a row of solar panels here, wall that off, move this guy out of the way. I'll probably seal this off with a spacesuit door. And that way I don't have to pressurize that entire half of the ship and I can just focus on all my efforts over here. It'll take a lot less water too, I think. Yeah, this ship is going to come together nicely. So let's look at that. 
Actually, I'm going to wait for them to redesign everything because then they don't have to be uncomfortable as they, they move. Let's delete that guy because he was hiding on me. I'm going to go ahead and delete this guy. I'll delete that guy. I need a pathway to get back here, is the issue. That is one of the problems. So, hmm. Do I need to isolate that or not? I don't know. I don't rightly know. We'll see. I'm going to let them uh, catch up on tasks, and then I'll come back to you in a minute. Well, we have the CO2 producer, and we are done with research. Look at that. How lovely. He's still not pooping. I'm gonna give him a little more break time on the back end. Oh yeah, those guys have two hours before they go to bed. I'm gonna give them two hours of break time here so they have enough time to kind of do their thing. There we go. Yeah, we need somebody on this ship, on the off shift, so he can sleep and not get murdered in it. Not have a horrible day. Uh, I need to figure out who I want to move over there. I keep saying that. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. How how does uh, Dylan feel about everybody? So if I look at Dylan White, I can move IHTFP over there because he has some negative feelings on a lot of people on that ship, but he would do well over here. Uh, yeah, I think he's going to be the candidate because I'm not moving Mark Little over, obviously, because he's the Capitan. Congrats, IHTFP. You get to go hang out with your brosif. Old Dylan White. Let's see, where are you at, HTFP? Where are you at? Come on. You're somewhere in here. I'm just blind this morning, apparently. There you go, you live on the Portia. Somehow he's set to not work on those. Odd. All right, well, you live over here now. I'm going to change you to... Shift four, I guess. Because it'll be the opposite shift. Actually, no, I'm going to leave you on two. That way you're just slightly offset. You're not super offset. I'm going to let him work over there because he's actually pretty good at that stuff. Uh, IHTFP, there you are. Let's check your... I think you were already on shift two, so it shouldn't be that big a deal. Who's on shift two up here? Yep, looks like it is kind of an opposing shift. Whoops, <laughs> you guys need to sleep during that time frame. There we go. Hopefully they poo themselves less <laughs> in the process. Or they can rectify it. Alright, this is getting there. So my thought is, if I just have like a central spline here that I can walk into, or just right here for that matter, I think that'll work. So I can get some more power going here. So ideally if I can power it first, then I don't have to worry about it as much. So that's a twofer. I don't know that I need a twofer. I'm gonna start with a one fur here. We'll get these three, and then I still have room to go one, two, and I still have two spaces, so. Yeah, I could leave like a space here and make that a twofer. Let me delete that, delete that, delete that. So I will do that, and I'll keep that in line. Boom, boom. Start with that, and then uh, see where it goes from there. Now, I don't know that I need this wall line here, so I'm just going to delete that. We're just going to make it nice and open processing center. Uh, I will also throw, I'll probably move all this stuff over here. Maybe make a little break on this ship. That could be interesting. Uh, let's see. I feel like I should have at least one of these on each of the ships. Yeah, so I'm gonna move this. This is gonna become like the processing room. <laughs> oh yeah. 
Now we're talking. That's going to go there. And we're going to do something Alberti brought up, like we should put chairs in there, like a waiting room. <laughs> That's what we're going to do. Oh, yeah. We definitely need one on here. I don't even have one on this ship. So let's go to... Where is that? Is that facility? That sure is. That's going to go right outside of their room. <laughs> and we're going to put furniture and a line of chairs. <laughs> oh yeah, that is definitely like the dental clinic or any anything in the military. Yep, wide up to get your shots. Uh, go ahead and sit here and wait forever. Or sit outside the first sergeant's office. <laughs> go meet with Top. <laughs> Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay, these are done. That was quick. Why is this inaccessible? Oh, because that's not deleted yet. <laughs> Let's get on that. Let's look at the links. I'm going to link directly into this line. And we'll just keep that going. All right. So I'm probably going to delete this. And this might affect some of my power issues. Then we're going to start moving stuff around. I'm getting rid of that. There probably won't be any water vapor over here. So I'm going to delete this. I'm going to start deleting these walls too. Because I'm going to isolate this. I'm going to start doing that now. So let's look at the airlock. Nope. Apparently it's under wall. Hmm. Where could I put this? Hmm. Huh. I'm going to make this easy on myself. Let me put it that way. This kind of puts a hamper in my plans here. Just a little bit. I mean, I guess I could bump his room back just a little bit. And get this. Or do this. I could isolate this. so this, Because this is probably not going to catch on fire too often. And then use the rest of this space for processing. And then do this. I think that'd work. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. There we go. I'll probably move both of these over here. Cause actually, I'm probably not going to go through that much of that, but if I can double these up and speed it up, I think that'll be perfectly fine. All right, all that's going through all this. It should be feeding out quite nicely. This is mostly a maintenance episode. I mean, we've cleared, cleared out that, that pirate ship. We're doing a lot of mining. We're remodeling. So I'm honestly, like, I'm at the point where how much more am I really going to do on this playthrough? I mean, I could clear the rest of these. Yeah, these galaxies are huge now. I could. Eh, or I could just let these guys go off into the distance if I find it. We're going to start a new playthrough on uh, Alpha 12 anyways. And I'm trying to decide if I want to start with a really small ship and just kind of, like, eke my way through and then work towards the robots and stuff and have a small crew that just kind of like bounces back and forth? Or do I go for this big monster ship? I don't know yet. All right, let me go ahead and wall this off because that's something I got to do right now. I'm gonna go ahead and, um, I guess I'm just gonna delete this for now. And we'll, we've got enough of everything right now. So I'm just gonna delete these. We're gonna get them out of the way. We'll rebuild them elsewhere. I'll probably get a couple more of these. Let me delete this. Oh, uh, let's, yeah, that's still going. Waiting on people to get things done. Great. Let's go ahead and go to, a, what is it, life support? No. <laughs> Resource. Let's get a couple of them. We'll get, no. Man, you zoomed in on me. Killing me, game. Cancel. Let's try that again. Composter. You go there. Why can't you go there? Is there like a... There's one of those. Okay, that figures. <laughs> hmm. Well, you know what? One more is probably enough. Probably enough. I'm going to go ahead and wall this off. And we'll go to... Yeah, sure, we'll go to here. 
That's fine. That will do just fine. Let's go ahead and continuously compost that. We'll do human meat, get rid of the evidence. And all that. There we go. That should be more than enough, I feel. Right, that's all getting built quite nicely. This will officially be an airlock. It's definitely going to cut down on a lot of that need. Good. All right. So, I have room over here. I could prioritize the smaller things over here. So, let's see. I could fit this... Here, I can get two of these to really up that. Uh, let's go to resource. Let's get another one of those Optronics fabricators. And that's blocking that. Okay, well, that's not going to work. Hmm. Hmm. Well, this is tough. I'm going to delete that now. <laughs> what else can I fit back there? How about this? That I can fit here. I'd like to get my finished production assembly all in one place, ideally. There's a lot of rearranging I can do here, obviously, and we'll see where it goes. I could bump this out a little bit more and just work with that. Move it to here and then get another one or two of these and then just rededicate all this to production. Yikes, there's a lot of work that goes into this. I could get rid of these. Let's do that. Because I don't really need them at this point. I've replaced them. Uh, and then... No one then. We'll go ahead and... Move some of this stuff. So this is going to be a big bottleneck. I think. I think. So if I get two of these set up. Just churning out this stuff. Build a little storage pile right next to it. We're going to get a whole bunch of production going. I'm just going to start deleting all this stuff, and then we'll start from scratch. How about that? How does that work? That sounds great to me. Delete that guy. Delete that guy. Delete that guy. Delete you. Oh, you're already set to delete. Delete those wall sections there. We'll see how the power goes from here, but... We're doing the remodel, finally. Finally. Delete that wall, get it out of the way. Let's get a couple more solar panels eventually. Well, let's actually plan them out. So let's go with power, solar panel, there and there. I'm fine with eating a little more space there. Those guys will feed into this one. We're gonna go ahead and get. Let's look at let's look at our resources. So let's start from the ground up, first and foremost. Do we have a tools facility somewhere? We do back there. Good. Uh, I need recyclers. So recyclers are my top priority. I'll cram those down here because that's where my scrap is, anyways. We'll overlap those. And what next? So those are going to get done. We need... What? We don't need too many of these, I don't think. So actually, I can probably fit two of those back here. I can. So those two will go back there. Chemical refinery takes up a little bit of space. So what I'm going to do is throw one here. Apparently not one there. Disregard. <laughs> that doesn't help me. Here's what I'll do. I'm not going to get too many of these, but what I'm going to do... Whoa, I hit the wrong thing. Wrong keys. Home row, bro. Home row, bro. Home bro, row. I'm going to throw this there. What is that? What is going on? Why is there... <laughs> Why was there a draft button out there in space? What is going on? I'm very confused. 
All right, so we've got these weavers that are going up. We've got two recyclers going in. We've got a chemical refinery. I'm going to go ahead and get storage for it right here. Yeah, that'll work. Cool. All right, that guy is going to link into... Apparently not that guy. Hmm. Kind of confused. I guess those are all going into here, and that's going into there. And it's just a feedback loop at this point, so that's not good. Um, hmm. I'm going to do a little lateral push to this guy. Okay, well, I'm going to let that finish, and then we'll figure something out with that. That's going to need juice soon. All right, that is done. Well, I can just feed this into this guy and this guy into this guy. I think some of these are going that way and that's going that way. And that's going to push to that. There we go. We've got a very weird, very weird loop going here. Okay, cool. All right, we got one of these. I'm just going to get everything on continuous on here. That's set up. Good. People will use this. What do we have in here? A whole bunch of random crap, it looks like. I'll put my energy refinery here. That should be my next priority, actually. Put one here, one here. We'll get two of them going, just so we can always process that stuff very fast. I'm going to get a refinery here. And I think as long as we put the materials nearby, it'll be fine. All right, so that's there. I'll put rules, select all. No, no more. There we go. I can't click things today. Uh, let's bring in raw chemicals. Raw chemicals and plastics. I think that's what we'll need for that, right? Uh, we'll need that. We'll need that. And we'll need plastics. Bring here. This guy is set up for the good stuff. Should be fine. Good. What's next? So we've got the metal refinery. We got composters, we need yeah, water purifier happens on another ship. Cool. We need an assembler and an advanced assembler. With the chemical refiner, we got we need the optronics. So if I throw that there, that'll be fine. And then I'll throw storage here. Yeah, here. Should be fine. Good. All right, you, we're gonna refine if less than five. Same with you. Yep, same with you, same with you, same with you, and same with you. Actually, you're gonna go to 10. I never set it to go. Crap, let's change that and hit check. There we go. That one's good. You're just gonna do continuous on all these. Great. I think we're going to get somewhere. This needs juice. So, let's look at power. This is going to sap this power quite fast. But it'll be fine. Okay, you're going to do if less than 10. Nah, we'll do 5. And you'll do if less than five. And we're just waiting on a few of these to go. Good. And you're going to do the same if less than five and if less than five. And you're going to get linked in. 
cool. This guy has no juice, so what I'm going to do is throw a little power node right here. Probably get rid of this thing. And from here, I'll bring all the biomatter over this way. Throw a little storage over here. Uh, let's go to storage. I'll throw that right there. Cool. Now we're talking. Look at this ship coming to coming together. Uh, what? Is this blocked by this guy? Crap. Well, I'm gonna delete that because I don't really need two of those. Actually, no. I'm gonna undelete that. I'm gonna delete this one, and then we'll be fine. All right, let's link this into this, and then I can probably dump that one. Let's relook at the links. Sever that tie. We'll make this one. There we go. And I'm going to delete that. No, not that. <laughs> that. Give myself a little more space. Cool. Ship's finally coming together. All right. Stuff is moving. Things are moving. Why don't you have a spacesuit? What are you doing? Uh, what? What are you doing? Is it because there's still some O2 over here? Oh, that's weird. <laughs> oh, that's weird indeed. Okay. Um, yum. Okay. Well, you need juice. So you are going to refine if less than five. You're going to refine if less than five. And you're going to refine if less than five. Okay, five. <laughs> there we go. Let's set this. Let's change the rules. Select all. Purge it. What I need out of this one is probably what? I need circuits. I need a couple of energy rods. We'll keep that stocked with like one or two. And raw chemicals. And then the fibers. So, rules... I'm going to set a minimum rule for two of those, and then we'll set a rule for these. Bring those here, and then I'm going to have you bring me these, and what else? We need... There's something else in here that I'm forgetting. Ah, these. I want you to stock a minimum of five in this. And I think that'll do that just fine. Okay, cool. Let's go to our... Oh, there's a civilian ship coming in again. Okay. Don't know why you're coming in here without a spacesuit. That's very weird. We're going to get more towards the finished assembly of stuff. Actually, we need one of these, don't we? Actually, no, we have that. What am I thinking? I guess everything got consolidated into this. There used to be another thing that we, we would use. Well, we don't anymore, so it don't matter. Uh, let's look at... We'll do the assembler right here. We'll do the or the regular advanced... No, the, the regular advanced. Yeah, the regular advanced assembler. We'll throw that... Right here. We'll get a little power node... that right there we cover most everything I need and on the production side for resources I will build an item fabricator right here and if I have all that then I can get storage and I will slap this actually I'll just do a small storage that's fine We'll throw that there, figure out what else we want to do here, but I think this will cover most everything I want to do. Look at that. We're getting more efficient. 
let's jack you into the grid. Go a little, get a little more of the power circulating through here. All right, you, if less than 10, and you if less than 10, great. If less than 10, produce that. Same there, same there. Great, we're getting more things produced. We got room for a bunch of storage along here now. Cool. This guy, I need to change. Set this to purge everything. I want you to give me all of that biomatter. Ah, uh, the Persephone. That's a different ship. What do you guys have? You've got some Energium. I'll buy that off you. I'm trying to, like, just really stockpile this stuff as much as I can, and I'll buy water while I can, too. Go ahead and send that to the Drifty Bits. I'll sell you a shotgun or two or four. I'll make some money on the deal. Good. The airlock is blocked. Yeah, I mean, this won't be a problem soon. As soon as people, like, shuffle things around. Okay, what do we need here? Here's the question. What do I need? I'm gonna need the steel plates. I'm gonna need carbon and all the metals. So what I'm gonna do is set this up for metals. Because what is this? That's the advanced assembler. That's the plastics. As long as I have all these kind of in a general area. But I want you to bring all this here. Boom. That's gonna be my raw metal one. And then what I'm going to do is put another storage right here. Yeah, right there. And that's going to be for everything this guy needs. <laughs> we'll just go down the line like that. See, this can work. This can work. This could be designed better, I'm sure. But you know what? Whatever. I don't care. <laughs> it's not my problem. This would be a way more efficient use of space, I feel. Man, there's still mining out there. This is nuts. I feel like I've accomplished a lot in this episode, and it's already at an hour of recording, so... <laughs> I think we're getting there. We're getting there. This is almost set up. Everybody was in here. What are you doing? All right, this guy, before I forget, I'm going to set this to select all, none. I want you to bring me... What? What does this need? I'll have this store. I guess metal sheets. The fabrics. Yeah, we'll have this do metal sheets, fabrics, and uh, boom, bring those here. And circuits, circuit boards, electronics components, that's what they're called. We'll start with that. We'll reorganize as we need it. But I think that'll work out quite well. Finally, we're done with this. All right, I think this is all going quite well. I'm gonna get some furniture wall lights. Right there. Get one right here. Keep it nice and bright. What are we waiting on? Looks like tech blocks. Well, that's gonna be a catch-22. <laughs> Uh, is there anything I can recoup those from? Does anybody have any? Can I just buy them from you guys? That would just uh, save me a lot of time. Yes, I can. Just give me five of those and send them here, please. I'll sell you one of these. There we go. Have fun. <laughs> That'll allow me to finish all this crap and then actually get my production of those things back up and running. So that'll be good. Not a lot of O2, so we have an O2 issue. Why? Is this not producing enough? I thought I had plenty of these things. I'll slap one in here just to supplement where I can. Uh, let's go with life support. We'll throw an O2 generator right there. There we go. Can't complain too much now. I do not have any gas scrubbers over here, so I may throw one of those in here. I'll cover this in case this catches on fire. Okay. 
These are done. I'm going to start fabricating the good stuff. Give me five of these. And give me... Five of those. Five of those. Great. Cool. I think we're in a good place. Yeah, I think we are. How's my O2 doing now? It's catching up. I think we're going to be fine. I'm going to put a vent in here because I think that'll help out with a lot of this. At least pump it directly in here. Resupply it. Uh, somebody going to get on that? It's delivered. It's just not done. Okay, it is done. And that fixed my problem. Airflow. So yeah, I don't think doors have as much airflow as they as you think. They don't push as much. I like for them to push more, but I think the idea is to mix vents and doors. Okay, let's... Man, I've been busy on that ship. What else we got going on over here? Too cold. It's a little frigid on this side of the ship. All right, well, I'll build some walls. And we'll make that into a door. That'll seal that room off a little bit. Uh, what else we got? I guess I could throw some stuff over here. Like some life support in the form of wall thermal regulators. Great. I probably need to set up some more rules on this ship to at least push out some other building blocks. I'll do that. I'll give you guys a little bit of each. I want a minimum rule of not 50. No. Give me five of those. That'll be fine. All right. That sounds like a great job for the next episode, but uh, we accomplished quite a bit. I got, I got to say, I'm pretty impressed. I think I like how this is set up. It could probably be a little more efficient use of space. I'll probably throw more storage here in the next episodes, but uh, man, I think we're doing pretty good. All right. Well, thanks for joining me, folks. Take it easy and uh, well, I'll catch you next time.